propeller. You use it to, it sends vibrations down your airways to help mobilize secretions so you can cough them up, keeping your pulmonary hygiene intact. So, you want to use this if you're, you're coughing up secretions daily um, or if you feel like you're more congested than usual. So what you do, it, it has little bumps on the bottom. I like to think of them as legs. Those go down. You wrap your mouth around the mouthpiece and blow. You could do this for three sets of five in any position that you want. Sitting, uh, laying in, in your bed, laying on your side. So I'm going to demonstrate right now. Make sure you never hold your breath, and if you start to feel lightheaded or dizzy, just take some normal breaths. Then you want to try to cough or huff to see if you can get rid of any of those secretions. So, to cough, you want to make sure that you have a deep breath in, hold it for a couple moment, moments, and then have two to three coughs. So deep breath in, hold. <coughs> One to loosen the secretions, and then one to clear the secretions. Another technique you could use is the huff. You could even huff with the, with the mouthpiece of the acapella. First, I'll show you how to do it without. So to huff, it's the same idea as coughing, except it's less harsh on the airways. So you're going to breathe in, and then make a ha sound. And it's almost like if you were fogging up a mirror. So, <sighs> You could do it two to three times. You can also use the, use the mouthpiece to help open up the throat when you're huffing. So you take the mouthpiece, flip it around to the circular side, and then you huff into the mouth, mouthpiece for two to three times. Good. And then if you're not coughing up anything at the moment, that's fine. Make sure you stay well hydrated because mucus is primarily water. So to keep that mucus thinned out, make sure you stay well hydrated and it'll be easier to cough up. So to clean this acapella, what you want to do, you take the mouthpiece off and then you put both pieces into a warm a basin of warm soapy water. You can let it sit in the basin for about five to ten minutes. Then when you're done, you want to head over to a sink, rinse these guys out, put them on a towel, let them dry, until you're ready until you're ready for your next use but make sure that they're dry and that you get all the soap off before you do this okay thank you very much for listening and i hope you have a great day and feel free to tune into this whenever you need some reminders on your diaphragmatic breathing active cycle of breathing or use of your acapella take care